Ito ang Mornings with GMA Regional TV. Pitong taong gulang pa lamang si Simon Luis Basilia, hilig na raw niya ang pagsasayaw. Dahil sa husay at dedikasyon sa pagbabali, naiuwi niya ang ginto at pilak na tropeyo sa kompetisyon sa Malaysia. Ano nga ba ang kanyang mensahe sa mga aspiring balerinas? Kapuso, ating makahakwentuhan ang isang young ballerina na si Simone Luis Basilia kasama ang kanyang mami na si Lynn Basilia mula Lingayen, Pangasinan. Masantos si Kabusan Sasa and Mami Lynn. Welcome to Mornings with GMA Regional TV. Good morning, Miss Ara. Good morning po sa lahat na nanonood out there. Good morning, Miss Ara. Good morning to all the viewers out there. Oh, I love it! Nako, kamusta po kayo at ang inyong buong pamilya, Mami Lynn? So far, so good po. By God's grace, we're good naman po. Ayan, and of course, Sasa, pagising mo sa umaga, ano yung una mong ginagawa? First, I actually usually pray. Second, I warm up. And third, I do a few ballet technique exercises. Wow, ang sipag mo ha! Anong grade mo na ba ngayon at namimiss mo na bang pumasok sa school? And of course, ano yung namimiss mong gawin sa school with your teacher and your classmates? Yes, of course I do love school and I miss working with my teachers and classmates. Oy, nakuha, grabe! Pero Sasa, mm -hmm. what is your favorite hobby aside from ballet? My favorite hobby... It's doing contemporary ballet. Wow, Sasa! Bakit itong nakahiligan mong um, klase ng sayaw? Because I actually really love doing the hard technique of that genre of dance. Oh, wow, so let's talk about your TikTok videos, okay? <laughs> you make the viral dance videos with a twist. Can you tell us more about this, Sasa? Yes, I do. First, I usually memorize the TikTok dance video. And second, I usually add a ballet technique twist to the first, middle, or end of that video to have a little technique twist. Wow, nakakabilib naman. Very techy rin si Sasa Mamilin, ha? Pero, yeah, po, nga po. <laughs> Sasa, masaya ka bang nagpa-perform at nagsasayaw sa harap ng maraming tao? Yes, of course. Yes, pero ano bang gusto mong maging uh, paglaki mo sa asa? Ano yung dream or dream job mo? I really want to become a neurosurgeon and a professional ballerina. Oh, grabe Mami Lynn! Ang galing! <laughs> Meron ka ng ballerina. Meron ka na rin pong doktor. Nakakatuwa naman po. And of course, <laughs> Mami Lynn, pwede niyo po bang i-share sa amin yung... Uh, Desirable traits po ni Sasa and the, what is your advice to her? Okay. As a daughter, si Sasa po very lovable and very persistent siya sa ginagawa niya. Matsaga talaga siya sa ballet dancing. And most of all, um, she is a God-fearing daughter. Ang advice ko sa kanya, Sasa, uh, i-continue mo lang yung ginagawa mo. And at sana ma-fulfill mo yung dreams mo someday. Ay, nakakatawa. Ang sweet naman. How about you, Sasa? What do you want to say to your mom? And of course, what can uh, you, what is your advice to the aspiring ballerinas like you? Uh, I just want to say thank you for supporting me and thank you for loving me unconditionally. What is your advice now? My advice to the young ballerinas is to be brave, always be confident. And second, be dance with your passion and third always be yourself oh i love it mommy please para hindi bata yung kausap natin ha <laughs> oh, <nga po. laughs> and of course po mommy lin ano naman po mensahe mo or advice mo po sa mga magulang to support their child's dream and talents sa mga nanonood po na parents na tulad ko support po natin yung mga anak natin sa mga gusto nilang gawin lalo maka, nakikita natin na makakabuti sa kanila. Iparamdam po natin sa kanila na andyan lang tayo sa tabi nila to achieve their goals and dreams in life. 
Ayan, I love it na po. Thank you very much, Sasa and Mami Lin. Have a great day po ha and always stay safe. Thank you, Miss Ara. God bless. God bless po.